just to identify this, this, those elections. Those elections were not very important. That every four years, it's district councillors. You have 18 districts. Hong Kong is not a one city. You have a lot of territories. 18, you have nearly 400 elected district councillors and you have 1,000 candidates. But it can send a message. It can, now, because of what's happening since June, it's in another dimension. It's, they are the mm-hmm. only free, democratic, mm-hmm. universal suffrage election in Hong Kong mm-hmm. now. Otherwise, there is none, you know, except for half the LegCo, the, the, the assembly, right? Mm-hmm. But then now, within this turmoil now, they can still be cancelled. There is still tomorrow. The government can decide if there is anything happened tonight or tomorrow night, they can decide we cancel. On Sunday, a lot of police, I, w- I, I, would, I would even say military people, because they are dressed mm. like they, they are raptors, you know, in every, on the poles, you know, everywhere. So it's not so, con- no, no, it's not so sure. But now if the people vote, you have 400,000 more people registered on the lists. So that means that more than 4 million people out of 7.5 are going to vote. So it's going to be a test, like, for anti-government or those who do, don't dare to, to talk for the government. We, we, we'll see. But it's local issues. 